cat wants custard. Kevin, Kevin, really, you have to shout while I'm trying to sleep. Time for dinner, Kevin. Now you've got my attention, but I'm not that easy. Keep talking. How about a special treat? Treat? That's all you had to say. I've got a lovely bowl of chicken and gravy. And I've got some nice sharp claws to scratch on your leg. A tin of sardines? Really? I should go about with fish breath? Beef? No, it makes me gassy. Pig ears? Gross! Waiter, fetch me a bowl of your best custard. Well, what are you waiting for? Haven't I made myself clear? I want custard. C-U-S-T-A-R-D. Still not getting it, are you? Okay, I'll spell it out using my body. There's a C. That looks like a U. And that looks like an S. That's a T. A. R. And a D. C U. That was tiring. Get the hint now. No, I don't want my tummy rub. Try it and you will not get that hand back in one piece. Look. I'm hiding in a yellow sweater and sitting in a bowl. Remind you of anything? See what I'm fetching for you? What rhymes with mustard? I just don't understand why it's so hard to get good service in this house. Well, there is one final hope. There must be custard in the fridge. All good things come out of there. I'll just wave my paw and the door will open. Or not. Maybe it needs a secret password. Meow. No, if I just, if I sit here long enough and stare at the door, surely it will open. I just make sure I don't blink. this the fridge is open and this is my prize delicious i knew they were holding out on me now to feast on all this lovely yellow slimy cold yuck thanks to david jones who was he was very nice and was able to let us take a picture of this book and visit my website, julianastories.com, for more really good stories. Thank you for listening.